What is going on guys, TD Presents here and I'm back with a new season of Mutt 25. We are currently coming off an undefeated regular season and also an undefeated playoff as we went on to win the Super Bowl. I didn't want to make too many changes because well, we went undefeated. So I was thinking, you know what, I think I'm going to grab a new defensive end, preferably one to start over Chandler Jones. And I was looking at Robert Quinn, looking at Deacon Jones, and I was looking at the back of their cards. But I was like, you know what? I think it's the front of the card that persuaded me to grab Deacon Jones. Just look at it. How, tell me that card isn't intimidating. So you guys can take a look at my starting lineup. You can see it is pretty much the exact same as last season. There probably will be a bunch of changes made at the midseason point depending on how we play. AJ Green, he probably is the most likely to move. But maybe he'll play well. I don't know. And then you can see that Deacon Jones card. That, that card's just intimidating. Don't look at it too much. And the secondary, it's still the same. Deion Sanders, Namdi, Joe Hayden, McCordy, and that Troy Palomalu that we picked up a little bit before the playoffs. So team's still at 96 overall, so let's get into it. It's time for the season opener. He runs a toss with Pierre Thomas. And for some reason, that little glitch where you can't dive when you're behind the person. Yeah, that happened right there in that play. So he comes back in second and six, runs a screen pass. And it's lagging a little bit, but Pierre Thomas... Getting down the sideline, he is pushed out of bounds finally at the 14. So on first and 10, he runs a toss play, but we blow it up in the backfield. Namdi with a great play, so he's faced with a third and 12. He's got all day in the pocket. He looks for his receiver, but what a play by Kyle Arrington. Dives to make that pass deflection, and now it's our time on offense. Who else do we find first? Demarius Thomas. Him and Brady had quite the connection last year. And now we're going to run our screenplay of our own. I'm not sure how Walter Payton didn't get tackled there. But we pick up a first down. It's now on first and 10. Brady finds Jimmy Graham across the middle. He picks up 18 yards. And we are moving on this drive. Now we look left side. And we throw an interception. I have no idea what happened there. You guys know I always throw the ball towards the ground on those comeback routes. I attempted to do that there. It just didn't happen. And then I see him dive in the end zone. I'm like, you know what? We have got to win this game. We're going to stop playing around. So I'm stubborn. I go right back to the route. And we find Demarius Thomas. He picks up a chunk of yardage. And now I'm going for it. I'm fourth and nine. Like I'm saying, I'm playing stubborn this game. We find Jimmy Graham across the middle. And we have a minute 55 left in the half. You guys know I'm going no huddle. We find LeGarrette Blunt. He picks up some nice blocks. He's going to truck over somebody. And just like that, we are already inside the 15. Now on third down, we run a toss. Walter Payton picks up some nice blocks. He gets into the end zone, and we are on the scoreboard. So I left my opponent about 30 seconds to work with. He rolls right, throws across the middle. Carlos Dansby comes up with the interception, gets a little bit of a nice return, and now we are in business. 26 seconds to work with. Brady going five wide. Looks across the middle, finds AJ Green who's going to run over a defender and get into the end zone. And just like that, we take a 14-10 lead. Now I get the ball in the second half. Walter Payton goes right up the middle. He's running people over. He's got open field in front of him. And we are taking control of this game. Two minutes remaining. We give it off to LeGarrette Blunt. Picks up some nice blocks. LeGarrette Blunt's going to get into the end zone. And just like that, we score three times in a row after being down 10 to nothing but my opponent comes back he converts a fourth down finds Dez Bryant so he's got about three minutes to work with if we get a stop here the game is over but if he scores he is right back into it and somehow we had four or five defenders around Pierre Thomas we couldn't tackle him and look at that this guy is still diving into the end zone so I'm like all right you know what we got to shut him up we give it to Walter Payton he's gonna run a toss can anybody catch him I probably should have kept going, but we'll take it anyways. It's just going to take some more time off the clock. I end up kicking a field goal, so I'm up seven. He looks across the middle, and Vontae Davis comes up with the interception, breaks out of a tackle, and we are taking this one to the house. And now my opponent, that's pretty much it for him. Down 14, no timeouts remaining. He's going to drop back to throw. Look at that user pick by Carlos Dansby, and you guys already know it's coming next. He goes on to rage quit. So now it's time for week number two. Brady playing with fire. The first play of the game somehow finds Jordy Nelson. I swear that went through the defender's hands. But we'll take it anyways. The next play, we find Demarius Thomas. He makes one guy miss. 
Thomas makes another guy miss, and he is down at the 15-yard line. We're still keeping with this five-wide set. Technically, it's four wide with a tight end, but hey, Jimmy Graham's a wide receiver. We find him for 14 yards, and then we run a toss play to Walter Payton. He gets in untouched, and my opponent quit that fast. Okay, so we are 2-0 heading into week number three. So my opponent is a pretty good team. I come out, Brady drops back to pass. He's got all day to throw, and I'm not really sure what I'm doing here. I look across the middle, and it's going to be intercepted by Lawrence Taylor. Usually, I don't make mistakes like this, but I was thinking to myself, all right, we'll recover from it. So he starts off with the ball, hands it off to Walter Payton, and oh my goodness, he breaks out of a tackle. Walter Payton is going to end up going all the way, and he scores first. So I'm like, okay, not too big of a deal. Brady looks for Jimmy Graham. Lawrence Taylor comes out of nowhere to grab the interception. It's already his second of the game. So maybe we're just off to a slow start. He looks left side, finds his receiver. Okay, that's fine. We're down 7-0, two minutes remaining. Can we get a stop on second and goal? No, he runs a fullback fake and a halfback toss. Completely faked out my defense. So I'm still like, okay, we'll eventually come back. We're down 14. We run a screenplay to Walter Payton. He's running people over. He gets out of bounds. And we are moving the ball down the field. Brady looks left side. Demarius Thomas. And we throw another interception. So it looks like the win streak is coming to an end. Unless we can turn this around in the second half. And he runs the same exact play. I thought for sure we were going to have a pick six. But he fits the ball into a tight window. Now on first and 10, he hands it off Walter Payton, who's going to get caught up with his own receiver. We have like six players there, and none of them can catch him for the touchdown. I was playing bad. Nothing was going my way. We're down 21-3. to Brady, he's looking. He breaks out of a sack, ends up fumbling the ball, and Jarrell Casey would jump on it, so he takes over. My defense was doing a pretty good job. We got him faced with a third and 12. He's rolling out to the left. He's going to fire this one to the end zone. And Nam D drops a wide open interception. So I'm fourth and 12. Despite me coming out in an actual defense, he still scores on a fake field goal. So as you guys can see, nothing went my way this game. I played awful. I had tons of turnover. So the win streak does come to an end. You guys are going to see a touchdown by me in the final two minutes of the game. Not that it matters. So hey, now it's just time for a new win streak. I definitely wasn't too upset about the loss. Just gives us something to look forward to and come back from. So thanks for watching this video, guys.